the fans have taken to it in the uh, first round of matches and they've turned out in force here. Good atmosphere in this stadium. Wholesale changes for Juventus. Neto starts in goal. Andrea Bazzali starts with Giorgio Chiellini as the centre-backs. Mario Lamina starts with Stefano Sturaro in the centre of the park. In attack, Gonzalo Higuain starts together with Simone Zaza. Barcelona's line-up here. Claudio Bravo starts in goal. Samuel Umtiti plays with Jordi Alba as the fullbacks. Iniesta plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. Luis Suarez is the lone striker today. Sergio Busquets. Well, he's appealing. <laughs> he was onside, but no way. No, I think it's uh, time just to get back in position. Forget about that one. Luca Maroni. It's a throw in for Barcelona. Iniesta. Return pass. And the attacking now coming from Barcelona. Working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal. Made the challenge well. Piquet. He does read the game well, this lad. Leonardo Benucci. Samuel Umtiti. Iniesta. Neymar. Ivan Rakitic. Did well, stuck out a foot and cut off the pass. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition, now they're here. Jordi Alba. Neymar. Samuel Umtiti. Luis Suarez. And he gives it back to him. Luis Suarez. Well read by the defender. Juventus on the attack. Trying to find a way through here. Probing away. It's Messi. Lionel Messi. Iniesta. Turnover there that we didn't expect. Luca Maroni. Ivan Rakitic. Lionel Messi. Iniesta. And he could get away here. PK! They have taken the lead. A dramatic moment. It's a defender who has breached their defence. I think they were almost taking him for granted. They didn't think he was one of the chief threats, but he was. has opened the scoring, 1-0 here. Luca Maroni. And in he goes with the tackle. Sergio Busquets. Luis Suarez. With the sad loss of Johan Cruyff, his contribution to Barcelona, maybe triggering it all off, was brought back into the public awareness, wasn't it? it was, um, his inspiration, he got Barcelona, all the coaches to follow. To bring them level. Higuain with a wonderful chance to get them level, and he's missed it. Well, a goal scorer supreme just forgets his lines there. Piquet. Just to go back to Barcelona and Johan Cruyff's influence, which was uh, spotted up, I think, in the obituaries when he sadly passed away. Yeah, he loved that 4-3-3 formation, which you still see here, really, don't you? A lot of defenders. He might be through. Suarez! And they have scored. And they do lead now by two. And they've worked very hard for this. It should get them across the line at the end of the match. We'll see. He's an impetuous goalkeeper, this one. 
and it's cost him here. Well, he did go AWOL, but the scorer was Johnny on the spot to make him pay. Good finish. Looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. Lionel Messi. And that's across the field to try and switch the play. Found his teammate well. And now the shot. And a goal into the bottom corner. Well, with that goal, Alan, it should wrap it up for Barcelona. Well, I would have thought so. Surely no way back now. Barcelona's very quickly to their stride today. They're doing brilliant. Piquet. Sergio Busquets. Jordi Alba. Probing away. Trying to find room for a shot, maybe. And the decision for the added time is three minutes. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Made the challenge well. So we reached the... Here we go into the second half of this second match in the group stage. Looking forward to it. It was uh, quite a closely run affair, so uh, I wonder if that will continue in this second half. Comes in with a tackle. Sergio Busquets. Neymar. There's some potential in this move. Oh, he could be in. He's got his shot off now. Neymar! Excellent work. Important moment, maybe the most important moment in the match. They shouldn't be caught from here, should they, Alan? I don't think so. There'll be questions asked if they are. And to be honest with you, Martin, the opposition looks down and out down there. So they're looking for more at 4 0. He went in well. Ivan Rakitic. Attacking well here. Tries the through pass. It could be a chance. Messi! He's done it again. Well, there is a big difference between these two teams, and that goal has meant it's reflected in the scoreline. I think uh, it's going to be a stroll from here on in because they've got a big cushion. Rightly so, well in the lead. If you're losing count, it's 5-0. Luca Maroni. Oh, he showed great anticipation there. Luis Suarez. Samuel Umtiti. And the attacking now coming from Barcelona. Sergio Busquets. Oh, and Barcelona. Shots off! And Neymar with the goal! Well, he's doubled up here with his second goal, and he took it in excellent style, just like the first one. Well, the match a long time over here, 6-0 now. Luca Maroni. Stefano Sturaro. Well, when they do say, and you've been in these matches, about the psychology of getting it right on the big day, you would have thought ability-wise it's uh, very much uh, level pegging here but in fact one side seems far more up for it than the other yeah i think that does seem to be the case whether the one manager has uh, pumped up his players got them ready better than his opposite number that seems to be the case at the moment one of the sides is going to make a change and there is some uh, backup for him in this position shots on here the shots hit the post He's cleaned up here, hasn't he, with that clearance. And that is now a goal kick. Miralem Pjanic. Barcelona to get the throw. Jordi Alba. 
you think about football as a passing game, which it is, you think about players like him. It's been a very good game, and the substitutes might be able to make it even better. We're going to get a change. The score! And now Messi, he's put it away with his usual style. Well, scoring in any game is worthy of celebration. When you get two, it is special, and he is feeling that special delight at the moment. There's only really one team in it, only one team enjoying this. When you look at the scoreline, 20 minutes of the 90 still to play. Not rushing it here, moving from one side to the other. Well, this is how this team can play sustained attacking football but when they lose it as they've done now it's just a risk that they might get caught out you see so often the impact of substitutes we're going to see a substitution here he can't miss oh what a chance to get themselves back into the game that could haunt him well to miss a chance so glaring in any match is bad enough but in these circumstances it's a shocker and now Iniesta Sergio Busquets. Pass, pass, pass. And the player with the ball has so many options, so they work so hard off the ball to make those options possible. Yeah, and it's not been passing for passing sake either. They've uh, made inroads into the enemy territory. Opportunity here, and he's done it. Keeper couldn't get down quickly enough to deal with such a low and effective shot. And it's so hard to counter Martin, that one, two touch stuff. The understanding between this team, well, the opposition couldn't get near. He took the chance with absolute precision, Alan. It wasn't an easy one either, that Martin, but he made it look so. Totally one sided, really, the match, as the scoreline suggests. Miral Pjanic. And he's got the ball away from him with the tackle. There's going to be a throw in after that tackle. And on the clock. Eight more minutes. Working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal. Juventus on the attack. Typified the competitive nature of this game, that tackle. It's only a throw-in. Chiellini. Good interception. Ivan Rakitic. Lionel Messi, Samuel Umtiti, a break maybe from Barcelona. Well, good through ball. And here it is, class act, Ivan Rakitic, another illustration of his class now. Not there when needed, the goalkeeper, as it turned out. No, one or two of his defenders looking at him, having words, and you can understand why. Poor decision from him. There's only really one team in it, only one team enjoying this, when you look at the scoreline. Tries the through pass. And the decision for the added time is three minutes. Sergio Busquets. And Barcelona. He might be through. 